Kane, please tell me how your magic flask works, because I want to become very big. Actually, it's absolutely not difficult at all. You just need to set some parameters on the control panel, and then enter the flask itself. The main thing is, of course, to follow safety procedures. Oh no, what's that? Where did this giant Peppa Pig come from? We need to run away from here as soon as possible, Kane. Apparently, there's absolutely no way for us to get out of here, because she has blocked the entire exit. Oh no, she's trying to tie me up right now and take me somewhere. Please help me, Kane. Unfortunately, I absolutely can't help you, because she tied me up too. As I understand it, we will have to go with her. I hope she at least isn't leading us to a huge bonfire to roast and eat us. Kane, can't you take out your staff right now and try to free us somehow? Unfortunately, I sent my staff for repairs because Kalfmo broke it when he borrowed it for just a couple of minutes. It looks like I managed to free myself from a rope and I want to hide in this cave. I think that's really not the best idea of yours, but we really have no choice. Oh no! It seems we chose the wrong path because there is no other exit from this cave. Hey, Peppa Pig, let us out of here immediately. She didn't listen to me. We can only hope that someone heard our screams and might start looking for us. However, I have a Monopoly game with me and we can play together while we wait for help. That's a great idea. In that case, get the game out as soon as possible. Hello, dear friends, and just look where I am right now. I came to have a bite at McDonald's, but unfortunately, for some reason, there's no one here. I really don't understand why Jax isn't at work today. Hey, Kofmo, what are you doing here at all. Pomni, don't you know what happened to Jax and Kane? Actually, I'm not aware because I just woke up a few minutes ago. I was fixing a plane on my balcony and saw a giant Peppa Pig trapping them. Are you kidding me? I really don't understand how this is even possible. At first, I couldn't believe my eyes either, but it's absolutely true, and that's why we need to go there and figure out everything that's happened. I have no plans for today, and even if you're fooling me, it's still some kind of entertainment. By the way, maybe we should take a potion with us just in case. That's exactly what I was about to do, so we'll both go go to Kane's circus and try to find something useful there. I really hope we can find some kind of potion in his circus. We definitely need to go up to the second floor of the circus because that's where Kane keeps all his potions. Of course, besides the ones he keeps in his laboratory, but it's too far to go there. By the way, there are a lot of boxes there. I hope you know where to look. As far as I remember, the restoration potions should be in this box. By the way, do you happen to know where the giant Peppa Pig came from in the amazing digital circus? I saw her wandering around the circus since early morning. She seemed very kind to me, so I didn't pay attention to her. Initially, she's kind, but if something disturbs her, she immediately starts destroying everything in her path. I think we can head to the closed cave where our friends are now? Wait, but if the cave is closed, we definitely need to take some tools to open it. I have this staff with me, with which I can easily break down the wall. I think we're absolutely ready and can go to the cave where our friends are. I hope they are in good shape. As far as I know, in closed caves, people often lack air. Plus, they've been there for a long Time. Wait, what's that over there by the tree? Don't worry about that. Those are just firecrackers I prepared for a little prank. Make sure to return them to me later. I will definitely return the firecrackers to you after we save our friends. For now, you better tell me where the cave is where our friends are. I don't remember exactly where the cave was. Look here. There's webs seeping through. I'll dig out the passage a bit and you can go inside. Oh no, not this. This was what I feared the most. Our friends are lying here unconscious. Just look at this. I warned you beforehand that they probably lost consciousness. Let's quickly use the restoration potion. Can you give it to me so I can throw it to them? Here's the potion. Quickly throw it to our friends so they can come to their senses. This web is really annoying. Well, just be careful. It's an integral part of any case. I hope this potion isn't expired and our friends can come to their senses without any problems. Hooray! It really worked! Oh, that Peppa Pig! I will definitely teach her a lesson as soon as I get some rest. She's really gotten on my nerves with her antics. For now, let's get out of here, as it's not very pleasant to stay in this dim cave. However, now you owe me for my help and we'll have to settle up. I will definitely help you since you helped me. I hope that giant Peppa Pig hasn't managed to get to my McDonald's. Otherwise, she's in for it. The last time I was at McDonald's, she definitely wasn't there. So, I don't think you need to worry about that. By the way, where did Kane go? Sorry guys, I just got a little dizzy, so I was a bit delayed. Since everything turned out well, I suggest we go to McDonald's right now and grab a bite. I haven't eaten anything today, and I really want to have a couple of burgers. I'll treat you to the freshest and juiciest burgers in the entire amazing digital circus. By the way, I was already at McDonald's today, but unfortunately, I didn't find anyone there at all, so I couldn't eat. I hope everything will go much better now. Oh no! Just look at the roof of McDonald's! I don't understand where it came from at all. You told me she wasn't there and everything would be fine. I swear to you, when I was at McDonald's, there was no giant Peppa Pig. It seems that while we were rescuing you, she managed to run there and started wrecking everything. 
Oh no, she's standing on the table right now and trying to eat all the burgers she can find. I'll definitely teach her a lesson for trying to eat my burger. Guys, you need to wait just a few seconds. I'll soon get my staff and try to heal this Peppa Pig to make her kind again. I sincerely hope I can do it and we won't have to kick her out of our amazing digital circus. <laughs> Wow, I didn't even hope that your spell would actually work. I'm really glad I won't have to fight her because she won't just destroy my McDonald's anymore. By the way, Pomni, would you like to take this pig home with you? Honestly, I really don't want to. However, we can try to place her in Regatha's house because she's very hospitable and certainly won't mind having a cute little pig living with her. That's a really great idea because Regatha loves all kinds of animals. Let's head to Regatha's house as soon as possible and show the pig Peppa her new home. Guys, I really want to go with you, but unfortunately my workday isn't over yet, so I need to go back to McDonald's. By the way, if you're not aware yet, Ragatha's house recently got a new basement, and we'll show it to you right now. Unfortunately, it's not yet equipped for living, but Ragatha promised to fix that soon. It's indeed a great place, but I can't help but wonder what this passage behind me is for. Honestly, I don't know, but we can go in and see where it leads. Wait, what's this? Did Ragatha build a whole tunnel just to watch Jax sleep? And it's actually good that Jax isn't Have with us. Have you all gone completely mad here? Don't you know it's very rude to enter someone else's house without the owner? permission? Not only did you come here, but you also brought some pig with you! Actually, this pig will now live with you. I will by no means allow her to live with me. Get out of my house immediately! Unfortunately, pig, it seems we'll have to find you a new home where you can live while we come up with something else. Welcome to the amazing Digital Circus! Today, Jax decided to sneak into Pomni's house and spy on her in the bathroom! Hey guys, today's video is gonna be super fun and awesome. It'll totally lift your mood and make you smile. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel. Oh man, guys, today I want to sneak a peek at Pomni. I've got this clever plan and Pomni won't have a clue, just in case I've got a backup plan to make a quick exit. I've been thinking about how to sneak a peek at Pomni when she's taking a bath and figured out a way to build a bridge from my house to hers. Wow, yeah, the view from here is legit. Now I can watch Pomni taking her bath through her window, and if she spots me, I'll just bolt back to my place. Wow, I just love taking baths. It's such an amazing way to chill out and take care of myself. Yeah, for real! Taking baths in this incredible digital world is super cool! I really like it! I think Pomni's getting suspicious. Gotta dash back to my place before she sees me. Oh my gosh, guys! I absolutely love taking a hot bath. It's such an awesome way to chill out and take care of myself in this wild digital circus. Taking a bath is so nice! Seriously, guys, a hot bath really helps to unwind after a tough day. I wonder where my friends are. Gotta head downstairs and check. Let's go, guys. I'm super curious about where Jax is. Oh my gosh. What is this, guys? It looks like some kind of bridge leading to Jax's house. To my house. What does it mean? Who built this bridge, guys? We need to go up and see. Really curious about who built this bridge and why. So let's head up and figure it all out. So guys, I'm already upstairs. Let's break this glass to try to figure out what's happening here. Yeah, really, everything looks super weird and it's unclear who would need to build this bridge. Oh my gosh. Guys, it's Jax, it's you. I just knew it. Get over here now. Jax, did you build this bridge to watch me? No, no, I wasn't watching you. I didn't build this bridge at all. I don't know where it came from. I've been with Kane all this time. I have no clue where this bridge could have come from. I definitely didn't have anything to do with it. Come on, Jax, come on out! What will Kane say if I ask him whether he was with you? Why did this weird bridge end up leading right to my window? All right, it was me. I just wanted to connect our home so we could easily visit each other. Are you kidding me? I know why you built this bridge. To spy on me in the bathroom. This bridge leads right to my window. Remove your bridge before Kane sees it. Meanwhile, I'll go for a walk and check on Kane. Kane, Kane, hello? You look really strange and unusual, like something's changed in you. You've changed a lot. Oh yes, the thing is, in our amazing digital circus, there's been a new update, and now my model looks much better than before. Write in the comments which Kane model you think is better, the new one or the old one. Yeah, you really do look better than before, but that's not what we're talking about right now. I need your help, Kane. Jax is spying on me again. Now he's built a bridge to my house to watch me. Well, I have an idea. I recently got some new cameras and I can give them to you. We'll place cameras in Jax's house, and you can watch him anytime. 
Here, take these cameras and the computer you can use to watch Jax! Can we install the cameras without Jax noticing them? Because if he sees the cameras, he'll definitely break them! The cameras are very discreet. He definitely won't notice them because he usually doesn't notice anything except his missing carrot. Ha ha! Yes, Pomni, take these cameras, the computer, blocks, and a ladder. They'll help you sneak into his house and set up the cameras! Kane, will you help me install the cameras in his house? It would be really boring to do it alone. Just keep an eye out to make sure Jax doesn't come home and see us installing the cameras. Distract him if needed. Yeah, sure, I remember. I can help you. Why does Jax always bother you? It seems like he likes you. That's why he behaves like this. Well... Look, Kane! Do you see? There's no window here! Come over here! Look, this is the very bridge that Jax built! All right, now I'll break this bridge and we'll set up the cameras. Be careful! Don't fall, just like that. Good! Yes, I think this spot for the camera will be very good. What do you think, Kane? He won't notice it, will he? This spot is really good for a camera. I think Jax won't notice it! Jax won't notice the camera! So now I'll connect it like this to the computer. There. The camera is connected. Just two more cameras to place, then I can watch Jax at any time. Now, I'll break these blocks. Kane, can you please board up my window while I set up the cameras in Jax's house? Yes. Yes, I'll board up the window, and then we'll go set up cameras in Jax's house. Wait for me downstairs. I'll come down in a bit. So, guys, I need to quickly go down the ladder and set up the rest of the cameras. All right, guys. Let's put a camera here and then go up the ladder into Jax's house to place cameras so I can see what's happening in his house. We have to get up to gently climb the stairs. Come on, guys. I can. Look, there's Jax looking out the window. Be very careful. While he's distracted looking out the window, we need to set up the cameras, connect them, and leave unnoticed. Great, you did it. Let's go. Come down, Kane, faster. Hurry, get down the ladder before he sees us. Looks like you were right. He really doesn't notice anything. Ha ha ha. Now I have access to video from his house anytime. Thank you so much, Kane. I couldn't have done it without you. Glad I could help. If you need anything, just ask. Jax has been behaving badly lately and really deserves a punishment. If he tries to spy on you again or builds another bridge, tell me and I'll help deal with him. All right, good, Kane. If I need help, I'll ask you. Thanks. I'll go home and watch what Jax is up to on my computer. I'm really curious about what he's doing and whether he'll spy on me again. Oh my gosh, just look at him. He's going to build another bridge, that naughty guy. Why is he doing this? I told him not to build a bridge, but he wants to spy on me again. Now he's about to finish the bridge and will start spying on me again. Guys, he built a bridge right to my window, and now he's going to watch me in the bathroom. Guys, look, he's almost finished his bridge. Look, guys, he's peering through the window into my room. Let's switch to another camera and see what's there. Jax has already returned to his house, and he seems upset that I wasn't there. Look at him, he's back at his house. Ho-ho, I built the bridge to her window again. But unfortunately, she's not home. Well, no big deal. I'll come by later and watch her, haha. -ha. So guys, I have to go and tell about it, Kane. Guys, did you hear what he said? He wants to spy on me again. But I wasn't home. So let's go up to my bathroom and see what's happening there. Really curious why Jax built his bridge again. Indeed, the cameras weren't lying. The bridge is built. I need to hurry down and go to Kane. He can definitely help me figure out how to teach Jax a lesson. Let's run, guys. I'll tell Kane everything and he'll surely help me! Jax needs to be taught a lesson. Kane? Kane? Are you home? I need your help again! Jax has built another bridge from my house to his, and he's spying on me when I'm in the bath. I just saw him on the camera. Holy moly! I didn't even know Jax was capable of that! Good thing we installed the cameras. Now we have proof it was really Jax. He needs to be taught a lesson! Yes! I saw him building his bridge to me! He built the bridge and then looked through the window into my room, didn't see me, and went back to his house! I heard him saying that I wasn't home, but he'll return later when I'm taking a bath again. Hmm, looks like that might really be the case. Do you have any ideas on how to teach him a lesson? Let's hurry, Kane. I'll probably come up with something. I think so. If you come up with some way, that would be great, because other than tying him to a chair and leaving him in front of a carrot, I can't think of anything else. Ha ha! Kane, 
You haven't forgotten how you can transform into me, have you? We can catch Jax red-handed. For instance, you dress up as me and take a bath, splashing around. Meanwhile, Jax will come over the bridge to you and watch. I'll sneak up behind him, scare him, and he'll fall off his own bridge. Yes, Pomni is a very good plan. I can turn into you. Ha ha, now I look like you. So what should I do next? Sit in this bath and wait. Jax should be coming soon, and he'll be watching you. Meanwhile, I'll be watching from the cameras. All right, guys. Let's see if Jax will be spying on us. So, guys, let's see what's happening on the camera. There's Jax. He's appeared in the frame. He's looking in the window and seems not to be doing anything yet. Where is he moving to? I think, guys, he's heading towards the bridge, and now he's going to watch me. Look at him! I'm going to turn off the camera and watch him from below! Yes, he's really watching me in the window as I bathe. Let's check another camera. Jax has become so bold. Look at what he's doing! Let's switch to camera! He's looking in the window at me bathing. We must teach him a lesson! Alright guys, let's go up the stairs and teach him! Now I need to scare him! The main thing is to approach unnoticed, so Jax suspects nothing! Let's go guys! He's looking in the window. I hope he doesn't hear me approaching. I must get up quietly and place the cameras. You need to sneak up on the roof and quietly approach him and scare him so that he has no desire to watch anyone. Jax does not see me and does not turn around. If I do everything quietly, I can scare him. So now we have to go through this bridge and I will show this Jax what is entertainment. So guys, the main thing is not to scare it. Jax, what are you doing here again? Are you spying on me through the window again? What happened, Pomni? Why, why are there two of you? Why are you in the bathroom here, Pomni? Please don't hit me, Pomni. I didn't do anything wrong. Nothing wrong? You're spying on me again. I told you not to do that. I don't like being watched. Please, please forgive me. I won't do it again. I promise. Please don't punish me. I don't believe you, Jax. Why are you watching, Pomni? She told you she doesn't like it when you watch her. I understand everything, but what you did was really wrong. I think you need to apologize and never do it again. Please forgive me, guys. I just like Pomni, and I love watching her through the window. You know you can't do that. Why don't you listen to anyone, not even your friend Kane? Okay, guys, enough saying I'm bad. I won't do it anymore. I apologized. Why do you keep being mean to me? We're still friends, aren't we? Promise you this won't happen again. I won't watch anymore. Remembering everything? I'm off. Bye, everyone. Bye. Stop! We're not done with you yet! He ran away, Kane. What do we do with him next? Should we chase him and still teach him a lesson? Ah, I think we can't catch Jax. He runs twice as fast as us. I don't know how to teach him a lesson right now. Today, I really wanted to swim at the beach, and I think we can postpone punishing Jax for later and relax a bit. Today was a very eventful day. Yes, you're right, Kane. Then I guess I'll go home. Take a bath without anyone watching me. Now, I'll go up the stairs and finally take a bath. Oh yes, I've missed a warm bath. I need to relax. It's good that no one will be watching me now. You guys also like to take a hot bath. I always swim in it. Oh yeah, I need to freshen up a bit, and then I can go to the beach to swim with Kane and have a great time. Kane is probably waiting for me. The weather is so beautiful outside. Let's look out the window. Yes, indeed, Kane is already swimming and waiting for me. I need to hurry, but first, I need to find some perfume to smell nice and wash my hands. Yes, good. After the bath, I feel better. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Jax, you're so bold. Why are you spying on me again? Why are you hiding behind my wardrobe? I'm going to teach you a lesson now. Running away, you won't get far from me. I'll catch you. You haven't learned your lesson, Jax. Kane, catch him, Kane. He's running towards you. He was again sitting behind my wardrobe and watching me. You won't catch me, I'll run away, ha ha. Kane, don't stop me. Oh, so you were watching Pomni again? We told you nobody likes being watched. And you keep doing it. No, Jax, I think you need to think about your behavior. Hey, Jax, stop and stay right there. What, why should I stop? You'll see for yourself now. What's this, what are you doing? No, don't, don't. Yes, we will, you'll get your carrot. Just try to reach it. Let me out of here, friends. Why, what are you doing? I didn't do anything. That's for getting caught. Well, let him think about his behavior, and meanwhile, we'll go and break the bridge. 
Guys, we're already up here and now I'm going to break this bridge. Jax is sitting and thinking about his behavior. I'm breaking the bridge and it's done. The bridge is broken, hooray! Jax won't be spying on me anymore. Keen, what shall we do next? Jax has a whole stash of carrots here. Well, I don't know. Jax has some kind of attraction built right out of his house. Maybe we should try his ride. It looks really cool to me, and I think it could be very interesting. Kane, do you think it's a good idea? Yeah, of course. Why not try it out? All right, let's try this attraction. I hope Jax hasn't set any traps on the way. Ha ha! By the way, Kane, do you see that strange black goo over there? Yes, it's the trace of Kalfmo. It could be very dangerous. We need to tell Jax about it and come check it out together. All right, guys. I think in the next episode, we'll find out what this black spot is. Well, Kane, shall we go? You go first. I'll follow you. Oh, this is so much fun, guys. Oh, my God. I love it. Such a great amusement. I really like the high speed. Wow, this is really fun. Good thing Jax put this railway here. I think by the time I check on our friend before we forget about him, he's been sitting there a long time, and maybe it's time to get him out. Jax, trying to escape our trap. Jax, stop. I didn't let you go. Wait, wait. Kane, he's running away. Catch him, Kane. I can't catch him. He runs too fast. Think of something. We can't catch him. Well, he got away, but we'll catch him in the next episode. Yes, we'll catch and punish him in the next episode. This episode is coming to an end. Guys, please like and subscribe to the channel to support us. We really work hard for you and thank you so much for watching. We hope that in the next episode we'll catch Jax and he won't escape from us. Yes, guys, we'll definitely manage it. Ah! Bye-bye. Hey, guys! Urgent news! Check out what I found in our amazing digital circus! Today I came to the mountains to start practicing parkour, but suddenly I stumbled upon some strange portal that wasn't there before in our digital circus. It's some weird unknown portal. I've never seen anything like it before. Really hoping it's not Kofmo's mischief. My friends will be totally blown away when they hear about my discovery. I don't know where this portal leads, but I'm super curious to step into it. But I won't do it because this portal seems dangerous. So guys, now I gotta tell all my friends about this ASAP. And you, dear viewers, smash that like button and subscribe to the channel. In today's episode, we'll definitely go into that portal and find out what's inside. Man, the water is so warm today. Seriously? The weather today is just unbelievable. So glad we decided to swim in this lake without the boys. They've become such a hassle, always causing some kind of trouble. Totally agree, but Kane is still a decent guy. Jax, on the other hand, is constantly up to no good. You're right. We should pull some prank on Jax, so he understands how unpleasant and gross it can be. Let's steal all the carrots, but only if our viewers subscribe and get us to 10,000 likes. Gotta check how my underwater carrot plantation is doing. Hope it's holding up really well. What a surprise! Didn't think two lovely ladies would be blocking the sunlight for my carrots. Am I really gonna spend the next few minutes peeping at the girls from below? How lucky I decided to visit my storage. Hey, Pomni, don't you feel like someone's watching us? Nah, I don't think so. We're definitely alone here. Last time I felt this way, Jax was actually watching me. So I think he's spying on us from behind some rock or tree. I hope you're wrong this time! I'm seriously tired of Jax's attention. He's too persistent. <laughs> now I want to prank her. Gonna touch her leg. This is gonna be so fun. Can't wait to see her get scared. And got it! Ouch! What was that just now? Someone touched me! Guys, that was really scary. Seems like there are some big fish in this lake. Get out of the water and onto the beach quickly. I don't understand what happened. It felt like someone grabbed my thigh. I hope it wasn't a pike or I won't be able to swim in our lake anymore. Wonder what it was. After weeks of swimming in this lake, absolutely nothing has touched me. Guys, urgent news, urgent news. In our awesome digital circus. Shut it, Kane. Something bit me on the leg. What could have bitten you? I eradicated all mosquitoes from our digital circus. Don't know, but when I was swimming, something grabbed my leg so tightly that I can guess it was a pike. Let's go see what it could be. Maybe a pike really moved in. Look, Kane, it was right here. I'll check right now. I got grabbed right in this spot. Wait, Pomni, why is there a carrot and a card underwater? What's this doing down here? What do you mean? Uh, don't you see? There's a whole carrot storage underneath us. Then we need to go down to figure out what it is. Look, there's a staircase. Let's go down quickly. Oh my gosh. When did Jax manage to create a new burrow under our lake? And when did he bring so many carrots here? Most likely it leads straight to Jax's place. So let's go ahead and ask him why he dug a new tunnel. Yeah, it'll be very interesting to find out why he put a glass ceiling in his new cellar. 
Look, it's Jax! Oh no, I'm in trouble! Quickly, run after him before he gets away! Why are you chasing me? I'm in my own burrow that I built myself. Guys, he's coming up! Hurry, after him! Did I really managed to shake them off. Oh no! Stop, Jax! We need to talk urgently! This concerns your new cellar! Leave me alone! I really haven't done anything to you today! Guys, climb up after him! Before he rides away on the cart! I've become smarter than you think! Ouch! Jax, don't push! It's high up here! Romney! You knocked me down! Don't panic, and let's catch the rabbit because we need to talk to him! You really think you can catch me? Dream on! Don't even think about riding after me! I have a secret hideout where you won't find me! I'll track you and find out where the hideout is! You're making a big mistake, Pomni! Guys, right now is the perfect moment to subscribe and hit the like button! Oh my gosh! Who broke the railroad again? Why is there some hole here? Your time is up, Jax. Finally, I caught up with you. Take that 50,000 slaps! Okay, okay, Pomni, I give up. Just please don't hit me. Now, answer just one question. Were you spying on us when we were swimming in the lake? No, I wasn't spying. You crossed all the boundaries? I'm wearing a skirt and Pomni has shorts? And you were right under us. Girls! I just came to check on my carrot storage and didn't know you'd be swimming right above it. I think you intentionally built your storage with a glass ceiling just to spy on us. Yeah, that's clearly wrong. At the very least, because carrots should be stored in the dark. Yes, this is really weird. Our railroad is broken, huh? How can it break when no one has used it for several days? This is very suspicious. Maybe Ragatha is just too heavy and broke the track. It's definitely not my fault because there's Kofmo's liquid here. Apparently it's his doing since only his slime is here. I'm so fed up with Kofmo. First, he's nice and gives gifts. And then he just goes and breaks everything. We need to find out why he did this time. What was his reason? You're right, but I'm tired of trying to understand everything Kofmo does. So what should we do now? I don't know, but I really don't like this. The appearance of Kofmo's liquid always brings bad consequences with it. Guys, I completely forgot why I came to you. Your chases and problems filled my head, and I forgot the most important thing. You won't believe it, but I found some strange portal. A portal appeared in our digital circus. What portal? I hope you're joking. I'm sure you're lying. Portals don't exist. I stand by my words. I really found some portal. In what? But in a portal, I won't believe. It's impossible. Guys, I'm not Jax to deceive you. I'll really show you this portal now. Come with me quickly. Well, I hope we're not wasting our energy getting to your imaginary portal. When you see this portal, your eyes will pop out of your forehead. I'm sure you've never seen anything like it. It's just some kind of miracle. I think Kofmo is involved in this! If Kofmo is really involved in this, then we 100% shouldn't enter this portal if it really exists and you're not hallucinating. Exactly! I still don't believe in the existence of any portals! Maybe Cain ate some poisonous berries that caused hallucinations, and after that, he started seeing ghosts and portals. Guys, look up! Some bridges appeared there! And these bridges lead straight to the portal! Indeed, there are really some bridges. I wonder what they're for. I still don't know! So let's climb up right now and check, and I'll also show you the portal. Let's climb up faster! To climb up, you'll have to use your arms because we'll be climbing up these vines. So be careful because they can break! Kane, aren't you afraid of heights? Did you completely forget? I told you that in my youth I did parkour for 10 years! So height is as pleasant for me as eating cake is for you! I completely forgot about that! Meanwhile, guys, we're already at the top! Come faster behind me and I'll show you this strange portal that appeared right inside the mountain! Yes, we're already coming! Guys, just be careful because we don't know what's in this portal and where it leads! There could be anything in there, even Kofmo's lair. I'm really worried. What if we go in and can't come out? Don't worry so much, guys. I'll go in first, and if everything's okay, I'll come back out and let you know it's safe to enter the portal. You've reassured me, Kane. You're very brave. I hope each of you is ready to walk on this shaky bridge, so let's go towards adventure. This bridge is swaying so much. That's why be careful. It's made of fragile, rotten planks. I hope we won't fall down. If you, Ragatha, eat less, then we definitely won't fall. How dare you speak about me like that? Look, there's the portal I was talking about. I've never seen portals in the amazing digital circus. I wonder where it came from and what it's for. Dear kids, right now, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel because we are getting ready to enter this portal. We don't even know what will happen. So make sure to hit the likes. Subscribe to find out what's inside. Guys, please like and subscribe because I can't wait to go into this portal. When I approached this portal in the morning, I heard some hellish sounds coming from it. I assume that it leads to some completely parallel world where danger might await us. We are ready for these dangers because curiosity is above all and we want to enter the portal. Guys, look up urgently. The There's Kofmo. Oh no, 
Oh, Kalfmo appeared as usual at the most inconvenient moment. Run faster. We need to distract him from the portal. Kane, what should we do with him? We just need to run quickly, and then he'll be distracted and run after us. Then we need to escape from here as quickly as possible? Great, it worked. He fell for it and ran after us. Great. Now we need to go down as quickly as possible, preferably spending a couple of seconds on it. If you're not afraid of heights, then jump after me, guys. Oh, no, Pomni, I hope she didn't break anything. There's water down there, but we need to descend more carefully because if we fall, it could be fatal. Guys, run along the edge of this water slide. It will be much faster, and Kafmo definitely won't catch up with us. If we run along the edge, Kafmo will notice it, and he'll also follow us. Kafmo overheard our conversation. Okay, let's run faster, but since I'm very afraid of the consequences, I'd rather follow Pomni. Good luck, guys! Guys, Kafmo almost caught up with me! Oh no, I managed to break free! Guys, come to me quickly! I'm waiting for you on the boat to sail away from here! Ragatha, hurry, swim here! Pomni will help us get out! Go without me, I'll manage somehow! Okay, be careful, Pomni! Let's quickly swim to the shore! I'm rowing with all my might! I'm sure we'll be able to save all our friends! Guys, hit the likes and subscribe to the channel because Pomni is putting in so much effort to save us! Why did you push me out of the boat, Kane? I actually wanted to save the others! Sorry, Pomni! Swim to save everyone faster! Okay, I'm already swimming at the speed of light to save everyone! Ragatha, get in the boat quickly! I'll take you to the shore before Kafmo catches up with you and eats you for breakfast! Thank you, Pomni! You're saving my life! Guys, look at my souvenir boat! Is anyone really not interested? Better put it in the water and sail! If you didn't know, Kafmo really loves rabbit meat! Ragatha, get out of the boat! I need to go back for Jax! Why? He already has a boat. He said it was a souvenir! Jax, quickly get into my boat and let's go to the shore! Thank you, Pomni, for not letting my souvenir get wet. Guys, we managed to escape from Kafmo, at least because we broke away from him, and he's still somewhere swimming in the lake! So guys, hit the likes and subscribe to the channel if you think we're very agile and outsmarted this monster. Not very lucky that I showed you the portal. I was about to jump into it, but then Kaufmo appeared. I wonder why he ended up there at that moment. Maybe he has some connection to the portal. What do you think is in this portal? I really hope that in that portal, there is a whole parallel universe where donuts and candies grow on trees. I think it's a world where Kaufmo was born. It's through this portal that he infiltrated our amazing digital circus. Okay, guys, we need to rest after such a long run from that villain. I suggest going to the new ramps that I built last night. That's a fantastic idea. As a rabbit, I really love jumping. Just be careful! There's a very high drop here! Pomni, why did you climb onto the highest ramp? You're very afraid of heights! Oh, it's really high here. My legs are shaking! Now I'll show you the master class, Pomni. Watch and learn how to jump from a great height! I won't watch your master class! I'd rather just jump from a lower ramp! Just so you don't think I'm a coward, I'm not scared at all! Pomni, you're really brave. You're awesome. What an excellent jump I had. It wasn't in vain that I practiced diving for ten years. Pomni. Do you really fear jumping from a height? Yes. After today's jump directly from the lighthouse, I'm very scared! You need to overcome your fear. Come on, jump from the highest tower. Ragatha, let's have you jump first! Agreed! I'm already going up! Come on, Ragatha. You can do it! Now I'm ready to jump! It's so high up here! Now it's your turn, Pomni. You promised to jump right after Ragatha. Okay, I'll overcome my fear, go up, and then jump. Come on, Pomni! You can do it! Guys, hit the likes, subscribe to the channel to support Pomni. I'm already getting ready to jump and feeling very scared. So I'll close my eyes as I fly down. Excellent jump, Pomni. You were afraid, but you did it. Thanks, everyone, for supporting me with your subscriptions and likes. It's all thanks to you that I overcame my fear and took the leap. Well, friends, I have some matters to attend to right now, so I'll leave you and head home to take care of them. All right, Jax, good luck. Thanks, guys. Have fun, too. Of course, I won't go home, guys, because I've come up with a brilliant plan, and I'll tell you all about it right now. Now I want to run around the pool, but do it in a way so that the others don't notice me, and then I'll sneak very discreetly under the pool and spy on the girls through the glass. By the way, guys, look how many chickens we have in our pen now. We need them to multiply faster, approximately at the same rate as your likes. So, guys, let's quickly and quietly head towards the pool. I hope they won't notice me because they are having so much fun. Great jump, Pomni! You've really mastered diving off the tower! Thanks, Kane! I'm trying my best! Pomni, maybe we can go on a date together, have some tea, or eat some cake? Thanks for the invitation, but I'll decline! Your jaw smells like an old grandma's! Actually, I brush my teeth every day with toothpaste and by hand! Ha ha ha! The guys are having fun and playing, and they don't even know what I've planned. Few people know that we have a special room for servicing and cleaning the pool. So, with the help of its glass window, I'll be peeping at the guys. What an incredible view. How I love watching girls from below. The main thing is that they don't find out that I'm watching them. Guys, how fun it is! Right now, I'll jump off the highest platform. 
falling from an enormous height. Kane, you're a real pro. I'm starting to believe that you practiced diving for 10 years. Thanks for believing in me. Thanks for trusting me. Of course, professionalism is evident right away. It's weird that Jax left so abruptly. Usually, he doesn't like to leave and always delays parting with us. Again, you're starting to suspect him of something. He's changed. He'll never misbehave again. The last time he disappeared suddenly like this, he later started spying on us. Maybe this time he did the same. Well, he can't be spying on us for the second time. That would be very strange and predictable. I think he can. After all, his low intelligence won't allow him to come up with a new plan. You're right, Ragatha. We need to check the pool maintenance room. Let's do it! I knew you were here, Jax. How could you spy on us again? You apologized and promised you wouldn't do it again. Oh, I have big problems. Guys, you all misunderstood. I wanted to check the pool's water supply. I think it's clogged. Guys, catch him. He was spying again and wanted to take off our pants. You won't catch me? You can't do it! I'm the most agile and nimble rabbit! Stop, Jax! Goodbye, I'll go far, far away from you. We'll catch you now, Jax, and throw you off this tower. You'll fall and scream in fear, and you'll never spy on us again because you'll be afraid of a terrible reckoning. While we're chasing Jax, guys, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and comment on what punishment Jax deserves for spying on us while we're chilling in the pool. I'm here now. Now I can toss you off this tower, and you'll be whistling on your way down. You won't throw me down, Jax! I know how to fight, and unlike some, I don't have delicate, infantile hands! But I'm really smart and cunning. I purposely led you to this rooftop. Guys, look around! Kofmo's behind us! Oh my gosh, it really is Kofmo. Guys, run down quickly! Move down quickly! Or he'll toss you from above and you'll turn into pancakes. Yes! Hurry down! Everyone for themselves now! If we all run together, the monster will follow us. So, we need to split up and disperse to distract him. She's right. It's good that we split up now with Kofmo. It'll confuse him! Epic jump! I didn't know you could parkour better than me, Pomni! Guys, run home to Jax! We can hide and take refuge there from Kofmo! This time, I'm not sure we can escape! It's like Kofmo is in the hungriest stage right now! Hurry up! He's about to catch us! He's just a few feet away! I'm already climbing up! Guys, catch up with me quickly! We're climbing right after you! We managed to escape from Kofmo! Did we really epically escape from the monster for the first time? Yeah, it was so cool! I had an adrenaline rush! I loved it too! Thank goodness Kofmo can't climb stairs! But this Kofmo has been really angry lately! Most likely because we found his portal! So, we urgently need to find out what's in that portal! We need to sneak in and check it out! Yeah, we need to do it ASAP! Guys, it seems the monster is gone! Probably lost sight of us and thought we vanished. Finally, we can go down and head towards the portal to see what's inside. I can't wait to find out what happens when we step through the portal. I think we might actually end up in another universe. Or maybe we'll just barbecue on this portal and turn into kebabs. This option is also worth considering. And Jax, you still haven't been punished for spying on us in the pool. The best punishment for you is to be the first to enter the portal. Let's see what happens to you. Okay, deal. I'll go into the portal first. Just please don't bruise me too much. I already have a lot of bruises. So, thanks a lot, guys, for watching this amazing episode. In the next episode, we'll venture inside that mysterious portal. So, if you want this series to come out as soon as possible, subscribe and hit the like button. Also, share your guesses in the comments about what's inside the portal and where it leads. Well, it's been me, Pomni, and my friends. Bye-bye! Oh, guys, I can't believe it! Someone took and stole my potion! I'm sure it was Jax because only he could take the abstraction potion. He always likes to show off above us. I think he's joking around this time, too. Where can he be? Look, it seems like he's singing in his shower! Oh, I'm gonna give him a piece of my mind! Why, I was just bathing here. What are you doing, Kane? Why are you in my bathroom? This is my shower. Jax, get out of here right now! I need to talk to you! What do you want? And why are you at my house? Tell me, did you take my abstraction potion? No, well, actually, yes. But really, you're worried about me? You know that potion is very dangerous, the abstraction potion. It can be very dangerous! And you just took it and stole it from me! All right, here, take it! Sorry, Kane, I just thought it was a restoration potion and took it! Never take my things without asking. It's the abstraction potion. It can be very dangerous, and you just took and stole it from me. What if you threw it at someone? Maybe I'll take it anyway. You wouldn't mind for a friend, right? No way, Jax! You know what? I'd rather throw it away so you never take it again because it can be very dangerous. That's it. I got rid Ouch. of the potion. I smashed it. There's no more abstraction potions. Ouch. Did you hear that? Did it seem to you, or was there some strange noise from below? No, I didn't hear anything. What's that about? 
Guys, guys, what's with the potion you threw at me? What happened? Why does it smell so disgusting? Oh, guys, I think something bad is happening. Oh, it seems we have big problems now. What's happening? Why am I starting to feel dizzy and nauseous? I think I feel really bad and I urgently need help. Kane, tell me what kind of potion you threw at me. Is it dangerous for me or not? Jax, we need to run to Ragatha right now and tell her about this situation. Yes, you're right. Let's hurry. This is very bad. You got me into trouble with Pomni. Hey, Ragatha. Ragatha, come here quickly. We have really big problems. Guys, what happened? Did Jax's carrot get stolen again? No, it's much more serious than that. We accidentally threw the abstraction potion at Pomni. What? Abstraction potion at Pomni? Why did you do that? You know it can be very dangerous. It was an accident. Jack stole the potion from me, so I decided to throw it out the window, and it hit Pomni! Are you guys here? It seems I can't see anything. Oh, this is very bad. What kind of potion did you throw at me? Oh, Pomni, I'm so sorry. I threw the abstraction potion at you. What do you mean, abstraction potion? You know it can be very dangerous. I can't see anything now. Yeah, I know, but we'll have to come up with something now. Are you feeling really bad, Pomni? I think we can make some kind of medicine for you. Yes, I'm feeling worse and worse. Oh no, guys, we need to put Pomni to bed so she can rest. Yes, I feel very bad. I'm going to lie down and I think I'll feel better. I hope you really do feel better after you rest. Kane, what if she gets even worse? What will we do? I don't know, but I think I can come up with some kind of restoration potion. Guys, I think I feel very bad and want to sleep. Could you please get out of the house so I can rest? When I've rested, we'll all go with you to the rides. Of course, Pomni, you need rest. We will not bother you. Guys, let's go outside and discuss what we should do now. Yes, that's a good idea. I think we need to discuss everything thoroughly. Hey, Jax, this is all your fault. Because of you, I threw the potion at Pomni. Why is it always me? If you hadn't thrown that potion, everything would have been fine. Why did you even take my abstraction potion? I wanted to see what would happen if I threw it at a chicken. Have you lost your mind? The chicken would have turned into a terrible monster, and now our friend is in danger, too! Oh, guys, what do we do? I think we need to support our friend Pomni. I think you shouldn't have taken that potion. Come on! You guys, stop fighting! Now is not the time for this. We need to figure out how to save our friend. Kane, I think together we can come up with something. Anyway, guys, let's go to Pomni. She needs our help. Oh, my gosh. Guys, is it just me, or has our friend turned into a monster? Just look at this. Oh, yes, it's terrible. Just look. Pomni turned into Kalfmo. Guys, she's not talking. We need to run away from her fast. She's going to chase us. Quickly get out of the house and run. Hey, Pomni, you're not a monster. You're our friend. Hey, Jax, I think she can't hear you. I think so. We need to run from her and figure out something to bring her back. I think I'll come up with a potion and we can save her. She's catching up. We need to get out of this tunnel fast. Hey, Kane, don't fall behind. Why are you running so slow? Guys, I got tangled up in controlling the boat and couldn't get it to move! We better split up now so Kofmo can't catch us all! Yes, that's a good idea. I think we'll split up and Kofmo won't catch all of us. Look, Kofmo is chasing me. There's some potion here, look. I need to jump into the pool now because Kofmo is very close. Guys, I think you should lure him so he's distracted from me. Look how scary he is! He's standing there staring at me, but he can't touch me. I'll catch you all. You have no idea what you've done. Hey, you, Kofmo. You won't catch me because I run faster than you. Oh, no, guys. He's chasing me. I need to come up with something fast. Let's take this potion and go up there because I'll be safe up there. Seems he really can't get up here. That's good. I'll catch all of you. You know you can't run away from me because I'll catch up with you everywhere. Kane, where are you? Kane, call Kofmo to you. Look, he's distracted by me. Hey! If you say you'll catch everyone, then catch me! Look! I'm standing right here and not running away from you! Oh, guys, he's very close. We need to run, Jax. We need to get on the boat and sail away from him. Run to me! We can get in these boats and get out of here very quickly! Yes, that's a great idea because, as far as I know, Kofmo can't swim properly. Yes, Kofmo swims very poorly, so we can take advantage of that. Look, he's standing there and can't do anything? Don't celebrate too early, Jax. I think we need to go back for Ragatha, because she was left there all alone and is probably very scared. You're right, Kane. We need to save Ragatha and take her with us. But for that, we need to figure out how we will distract Kofmo from the shore. If he runs away, we'll swim to the beach. I think he's starting to move somewhere. Do you see that? Look, Kofmo is trying to outflank us. I think this is our chance to save Ragatha. Look, he thinks if he outflanks us, he can catch us. 
We need to move faster for Ragatha. She's already waiting for us on the beach. Hey, Ragatha, get in quickly. We need to sail away fast to the lighthouse. Look, Kafmo is out flanking us and he's up to something. Hurry, get up this lighthouse on the cards. We need to get up as fast as possible because we'll be completely safe at the lighthouse. Yes, your laboratory is right there. I think we can come up with something. Guys, I hope we can create a healing potion now. Something's wrong. I can't control the cart. Kafmo must be affecting me badly. Kane, we're waiting for you. Come up to us. Where are you, Kane? We've almost reached the very top of the lighthouse. I'm catching up, guys. I'll be up with you very soon. See Kafmo running right under this lighthouse. It seems to me or he's too angry at us that we want to save our friend Pomni and now we'll be in our way. So, guys, we need to figure out how we're going to save Pomni. Let's go to my laboratory. Hey, Kane, rise quickly. You lag behind us. I hope Kafmo cannot climb the lighthouse and jump high. As far as I know, he can't jump high, but it can increase in size. And if Kafmo very angry, it can become by growth like this beacon, and then we will be very bad. Then you need to get the recovery potion and get out of here while there's time. Kane, I believe in your abilities. Kafmo is so small from this height. Look, guys, there's Kafmo. From this height, he looks so small. Now I'm going to get even bigger, and they don't even know it. Oh, no, he's getting bigger. Look, guys, what are we going to do now? Oh, I don't know. We urgently need to find a potion that can help us. I don't know. Kafmo is really big. Will the potion work on this giant? Yes, as far as I know, the potion can work. Kane, I think we need to hurry up before it became the size of this bridge and broke it. I think very soon it will be as high as this lighthouse, and then it will be able to catch us. Yes, it looks really scary. It grows very fast, and I have to come up with something with potion to save Pomni. Just stay calm, and everything will be fine. I really hope this potion really helps her, and she becomes Pomni, and not this terrible monster. Let's go! I have my laboratory here, and we can try to make a potion that will save Pomni. Run after me, guys! I'll show you the place! Oh, look! There's some potion near the portal. I think it might help us. Be careful! It might be poisoned! In our amazing digital circus, not all potions have good properties. Yes, I know my stuff. I think we can test it now! By the way, I also have some potion that I picked up on the way while we were running away. Yes, I also found some potion, but I don't know what it does. Kane, can you check what this potion is? I'll figure out what this potion is, and maybe we can make an antidote out of all these potions. Oh, that would be very cool. I'll do the potion while you go and watch Kafmo. If it gets too big, call me, and we'll have to make a decision very quickly. Well, we will follow him! I hope everything will be fine with the potion! Oh, I hope everything works out, Kane. Let's see where Kafmo is in the meantime. Look, guys, is it me or is he getting bigger? Yes, he's increasing in size! Kane, I think you should hurry up with the potion because soon he'll be able to reach our bridge. It's really getting bigger and I'm starting to get scared of it. Hey, Kane, hurry up. Seems now Kafmo will be able to climb up to us. I think he's really mad at us. I'm not sure it can become this size, but yes, Kane, you should hurry with the potion or we will be very bad. I don't even know how it feels now, Pomni. I think she is very bad. I almost finished my friend's left just a little. Everything will be fine, guys. I'm almost done. Guys, come to me. I think I've made the potion and it really worked. Oh, Kane, you did a great job making this potion. Yes, I managed to make a restoration potion and it should help our friend. That's so cool. We'll be able to hang out with our friend Pomni again soon. We will definitely help Pomni heal. I assure you that this potion will help her recover. Guys, look, he's suddenly running away from us. He's running towards the circus, Kane. It's very strange. Why did he suddenly decide to run away from us? Maybe he somehow sensed that we made the potion and now doesn't want us to throw it at him. Yes, you're right, Kane. Kafmo has magical properties, and it's quite possible that he now wants to run away from us so we don't throw the potion at him. So we need to run after him quickly so our friend can be with us again. Come down, gently! Kalfmo could have left here a trap for us! Look, he's standing near the circus and looking at us. I'm so scared! Don't be afraid, Ragatha. We've made a potion that can turn him back into Pomni. Oh yes, now I think we don't need to be afraid of him! If anything, I'll throw the potion at him and it should work! But what if it doesn't work and Kofmo doesn't turn back into Pomni? I can't remember a time when that happened! Usually the potion always works on Kofmo! Look, he's running towards our railway! It seems he's up to something and he's not afraid of us at all. I think we're about to find out. Look, he's getting even bigger. He's so huge. Why does he keep getting bigger and bigger? Because it's a very dangerous potion and in our amazing digital circus, Kalfmo can increase in size. Look, he's getting even bigger. But I'm really scared, guys. This is somehow very not good. 
Don't worry, Ragatha. I'll just approach him and throw this potion at him. Let's act now. I'm gonna throw this potion at him, guys. Help me if anything happens. Be careful, Kane. We'll help you if needed. I'm sure this potion will work, so be afraid. Nothing, friends. It always works on Kalfmo, and think everything will be fine. Guys, I think the potion didn't work. I wonder why the potion didn't take effect. Yeah, it seems like the potion didn't work. Look, he only got bigger in size. What are we gonna do now, guys? Oh, guys, look, he's gotten even bigger. He's so huge now. Run faster. Run ahead, and I'll follow you. Kane, why didn't the potion work? It always worked fine before. I don't know. Maybe it's because I threw the abstraction potion at him. That's why the potion didn't work as an antidote. Run faster. He's catching up. We need to think of something quickly. I've got an idea. We can go up to my house. He definitely won't reach us there. Oh, yes, Jax. That's a great idea. I think we need to go up, and there we'll be safe. Listen, why did you even throw the abstraction potion at Pomni? You knew it could be very dangerous. I didn't mean to throw the potion at her. Jax just stole the potion from me, and I wanted to throw it out the window so he wouldn't do anything bad with it. They'll never beat me! I'm stronger than everyone in this amazing digital circus! So what do we do now, guys? Well, I don't know, guys. This is the first time I've faced a situation like this. Now listen, Kane. why did you even create that potion? I didn't create it, I found it in a magic chest, and you took it! Never take my potions without asking! But you know it wasn't the wisest decision to throw the potion out of the window, right? I was very angry, and I wanted that potion to be gone. But now we have no choice. We have to do something about this giant Kofmo standing right in front of our house. What ideas do you have? He's pretty big, and if the potion didn't work, I think I might try something else. What are you planning to try? Do you have a plan? Guys, I have a magic staff, and I think it can help us. Kane, are you serious right now? You're going to defeat Kofmo with this staff? How do you imagine that? Well, this staff has magical properties, and I think it can help us now. If you think it's the right solution, then go for it, Kane. If something goes wrong, Jax and I will save you together. All right, guys, then let's go and try to save our friend. I rarely use this staff. Hey, Kofmo, look what I have for you. You know this wand can defeat you, right? Why are you so sure that you can defeat me with that wand? You can't run away from me because you're very big, and I will overpower you, Kofmo. You have no chance against my wand. You know that nobody can ever beat me, because I am the strongest in an amazing digital circus. I have very strong magical abilities. I think you'll see now what I'll do to you. I'll save our friend Pomni. So guys, I'm really scared. Let's try to defeat him. I just need to charge at him. Let's go guys, let's run. What happened to me, Kane? Did you save me? Pomni, are you okay? I managed to defeat Kofmo with this wand and save you. Hooray! Look, Ragatha! Kane saved Pomni! She's no longer Kofmo! Hooray! I'm so glad! Kane, you did a great job! Yes, guys, I told you, this wand has magical properties and can even defeat Kofmo. You guys threw some potion at me and it didn't work! I remember that! Yes, the potion I brewed indeed didn't work and things only got worse! Then I remembered that I have a magic wand that can defeat Kofmo! Honestly, I was very scared to approach him, but I managed! That's very good. The most important thing is that we were able to save our friend Pomni. You have no idea how happy I am that Pomni is back with us. Now we can have fun together again, friends. Yes, I'm so glad that we're together again. Well, guys, let's go to the beach then. Yes, that's a great idea, Pomni. I think we deserve a trip to the beach to relax after what we went through today. Yes, guys, I guess that's the end of this interesting and exciting episode. Guys, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. I want to remind you that our show is made possible thanks to you. Also, don't forget to leave your comments. Thank you all for watching. Good luck to everyone, and bye-bye. Helmet and ended up here. I'm in some strange place. Wait, what's this strange tomato with teeth coming towards me? Hold on, are those really just teeth instead of a head? Don't mind my teeth. I'm just here to help you. I see another person accidentally entered the mysterious world. What do you mean, entered your mysterious world? And what kind of world is this? How can I get out of here? Maybe you can tell me. Come on, I need to go to the bathroom soon and need to get out of this game. Oh, I'm afraid you won't be leaving here soon. Welcome to the amazing Digital Circus. But first, I want to introduce you to my good friend. Rabbit, come out. I know you're not asleep. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming out. Don't yell at me. Oh, I see we have a new person here. You're not lucky, but don't worry, feel at home. We're all friendly here. Maybe we can play a little, or maybe... 
Let's not tell our guest everything right away. This is very cool, but I don't like it here. And why can I always see myself from a third person perspective? Is that even possible? Where am I and what's happening to me? And since when are there such huge rabbits? Seriously, you're tall. You'll understand everything very soon. Let's go to the rides for now. You love rides, right? Yes, yes, of course, you even have to ask. Then, dear viewers, right now, like and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any new cool videos. A lot of mysterious adventures await us ahead. You have no idea what's coming. Wait, what viewers are you talking to? Maybe you can explain to me what's happening because I don't quite understand yet. How to put it? You've entered the digital world. Now you're just an ordinary character just like us. And viewers are watching us, those who are watching this video right now. Figuratively speaking, you're now a two-legged camera filming us. By the way, hello YouTube, now I'm going to be famous. Well, of course, if at least someone watches this video, it will be very sad if this video gets a total of zero views. No, it's hard for me to understand this. Of course, I've heard about the amazing digital circus, but I didn't think it was actually Minecraft. Oh, of course, this isn't Minecraft. Our universe has just shifted into the world of Minecraft today. And now you're not completely with us, but soon you'll understand. There's no point in explaining it to you now. I understand it's hard to accept. Go, go, go. Ha ha, let's put all doubts aside and have some fun. Wow, there's really a great attraction here. I've never seen such in real life. But I don't understand why I feel everything as if in real life. I feel the wind hitting my face, and I even feel the cart I'm riding in. What is this? This is called, you've entered our world through your virtual reality helmet. You know, sometimes a bug occurs and you end up in the game you were playing. Yes, I played Minecraft, but it was a long time ago. Okay, guys, I want to get out of here as soon as possible. It's fun with you and all, but I need to get out of here. I'll need to go to the bathroom soon, and I need to feed my cat, too. Oh, I'm afraid your poor kitty won't eat anytime soon. Believe me, you're here for the long haul because you have a very long journey ahead of you. You still don't know about our world and don't know who's waiting for you here, but let's not scare you prematurely. You told me not to be scared just now, but in fact, recently in our world, there are many evil and mysterious things. You'll find out all about it soon, but today, we're just getting acquainted with you. You see that strange button? You need to step on it! As soon as you do, real magic will happen! Anyway, listen up, Clownus. You need to stand right here, and then you'll teleport. Oh no, I don't like this at all. If there are really viewers watching, please support me. I have a feeling that I'm being tricked. We're in a digital church, so the rules here are different. I need to go there. Go, go, go! Wow, stop! What was that? I just had some kind of glitch on the screen, and then I ended up here. Oh my gosh, is this really happening for real? So guys, I think something's not right here. This is all real, and it's a wonderful world. Ah, I get it. This is just a normal dream, and I'm dreaming it all. Yes, guys, you're not real. I figured that out right away. Phew, I just need to wake up. This must be an ultra-realistic dream we're in. I don't want to disappoint you, but it seems she doesn't understand what's happening. Come on, Kane, explain it to her. Otherwise, she'll keep running around here not understanding what's happening next. Wait, your name is Kane? Yes, my name is Kane. And what's your name? Oh, no. It seems I've forgotten my name. I don't remember it. I'm telling you the truth. And I had a beautiful name that I was very proud of, but now I can't remember it. Wait, this is very, very strange. By the way, my name is Jax. Hold on. And who is that? There's some strange person right on the stage. But he's completely in the shadow. Or rather, I can't see his skin. Remember how I told you there are a lot of dangers here? Well, most of these dangers can be avoided simply by not paying attention to them. Right now, you'll be collecting apples. But please, never go to that stage. That's the last thing you should do. Never go there because we've already lost many of our friends there. Wait, you lost your friends who went there? But isn't this like a circus and the main place where you all communicate with each other? Or rather, you put on different concerts and shows there? There are things that it's too early for you to know about. So... Better not think about it for now, and let's focus on something interesting. Right now, you need to collect all the apples that are here. So, I'm really in an amazing digital circus, and all I have to do is collect apples. Thank you for at least giving me a ladder and some strange eye. I will collect these apples for you. Thanks for the compliment, but I didn't really understand what you're talking about. If you mean that I eat apples and therefore have beautiful teeth, I have great teeth so I can bite my offenders. 
Yes, that's exactly why he bit me in the butt when we fought. I remember that. I won't forget how you left me a big mark. Do you really think I'll just forget about it? You owe me for that. Oh, come on. It's just a mark on your behind. But now it's your unique story and mark, and you can share it with everyone. Imagine coming in and telling everyone where those huge marks on your behind came from. Guys, I understand everything. But maybe we can change the topic of conversation. And don't poke at me because I simply find your topic unpleasant. I knew it. She's such a bore. All right, Miss Boar. Go collect the apples and give them to us. They're our apples. Hurry up because we already want to eat and you still can't collect them. Or I'll make you collect carrots for me later. All right, all right. I've collected your apples as you asked. Actually, you're taller than me, and it would have probably been easier for you to collect these apples you're talking about. Fine, I've collected a bunch for everyone. Let's continue. What do I need to do next? Oh no, that's too few! We need 10 apples and they are right there. Collect absolutely all the apples and then this task will be completed. And don't get angry because then I might get angry too. Carefully make sure you don't miss a single apple. Greedy. Worrying so much about your apples. Dear viewers, I don't know what awaits me in this world, but I hope I can handle it. But I haven't watched this cartoon, and I don't know what will happen next. If only I had watched the cartoon, I would know what to expect here. Although I doubt they were collecting apples in this cartoon. Amazing Digital Circus is a very strange place. Deceive? No! Nobody is trying to deceive you here! Go on! Take it and find the last, the tenth apple that must be here! And quickly, because time is running out, and you were supposed to complete this task. But there is no apple here. I've checked everything here, and I've already collected all the apples. There's nothing left. Are you trying to deceive me? I don't know where you could have found the tenth apple, but it's not here. Of course it's not here, because the tenth apple is in his hand. So you deceived me, and I was just searching for your apples for no reason. If this happens again, I'll take you to the dentist. Believe me, the treatment will be very expensive for your beautiful teeth that will suffer. Ah, this girl, I like her. Calm down, calm down! This is not the last task that will await you. On the contrary, I am teaching you what to expect. Believe me, in this world, everything is not what it seems. Here, everything is completely different from the real world. You see, here what is good actually turns out to be evil. And evil might turn out to be the real good. So, you mean to say, with this good, you want to bring me harm? Guys, just so you know, I've practiced martial arts, so I advise you not to mess with me. My friend didn't mean to say that! I'm right, aren't I, Jax? Actually, everything here is quite safe, but you will soon know what's here and how it is. Just look around. This is indeed a wonderful and huge world. It's unlikely you'll find something similar anywhere else. But to be honest, we were bored because no people have been here for a long time. Go ahead. You can try the challenge that lies ahead. Wait, did I hear that I'm not the first person here? So you're saying that there were people here before me? Hurry up, tell me what happened to the other people who were here. Our tongue always gets us into trouble. Pomni, my friend, meant to say something completely different. Oh, I'm starting to forget that I'm just a camera on two legs. All right, in the next episode, we'll find out what happened to the other people who ended up here. I hope I'm not being lured into a trap and everything here is really safe. Don't worry! Dear viewers, like and subscribe to the channel! Become part of our big family! A big thank you for watching this video! It's really important to us! We exist to bring you joy! Let's subscribe! Come on, come on!